Hello, my name is Keith Hoover, Senior Quality and Application Engineer with Superior Essex, and today I'm going to show you how to prepare your EnduraGain cable for termination, grounding, and bonding. Here are the recommended tools needed to prepare EnduraGain cables for termination. For safety, use of personal protective equipment such as safety glasses and gloves is always recommended. In EnduraGain shielded cables, note the shield is bonded to the outer jacket to prevent slipping between the jacket and the shield. With the cable cut to a desired length, use a ring cut tool to score the outer jacket. Flex the cable about the cut to remove the outer jacket and shield. To expose the pairs, ring cut and score the inner jacket. Flex the inner jacket about the ring cut and remove. Use a soft, dry cloth, paper towel, or wipes to remove the PFM gel from the pairs. The preferred method of bonding is to use a bullet bond that slides over the inner jacket, underneath the shield. To accommodate the bullet bond, make a longitudinal cut of about one inch depending on the bond design in the outer jacket and shield to allow the outer jacket and shield to flare over the bullet bond. Attach the grounding strap and securely tighten with the supplied hardware. Your cable is now ready for termination. In Duragain armored cables, the armor is not bonded to the jacket, allowing the jacket to be easily removed. Ring cut the outer jacket, taking care not to cut into the shield. Flex the cable about the cut to remove the outer jacket and shield. The bullet bond is also the preferred method for bonding in Duragain armored cables. Make a longitudinal cut of about one inch depending on the bond design in the outer jacket and shield, allowing the outer jacket and shield to flare over the bullet bond. Attach the grounding strap and securely tighten with supplied hardware. Your cable is now ready for termination. An alternative method for bonding and Duragain cables is to expose the shield, which is required by some bonding hardware such as compression clamps and combination strain relief bond clamps. It is important to note that the coating must be scraped from the shield to ensure a good ground if the hardware does not effectively penetrate the coating. Please see our Enduragain OSP cable installation guideline for additional details about this method. For more information on Enduragain cables and other Superior Essex products, please visit the resources section of our website at superioressex.com.